it's uh, been a while since I've actually just sat down and chat, you know, without any specific idea in mind. Because usually every time I sit down and chat, I always want to have an idea of what I want to talk about. But I think today I'm just going to talk. Um, just talk, really. That's all I'm going to do. Um, I'm not going to edit much of this video because really it's just me talking. I don't know how long this video is going to be. It could be five minutes. It could be seven. could be ten. But I just want to get things off my chest. Um, I'm sure some of you do know that the Draw My Life video actually was intended to be my final video. I really wasn't planning on continuing after this, you know. I'm, it's no secret, really. I deal with depression. I deal with self-doubt, you know. Uh, my depression has gotten the best of me this past month or so, you know, from the whole year of just being, dealing with shit, you know, I, it does get to you, and eventually it will cause you to fall down in life, like I have, you know, this month hasn't been easy for me, I've been very depressed, usually I've been lying in bed every night, Morning not lie, I've been a little bit suicidal as well, nothing done, but I've had a lot of suicidal thoughts. You know, it's really tough to have this as a dream. It's really tough to have this as a goal. I'm just going to be straight up honest with you guys. You know, like, I, you think that this is just a fucking game to me. It's not. You know, I don't do this just to make people laugh and have fun. You know, this is my goal. This is my dream, you know. I've spent five grand in total and I'm put myself in damn near debt twice already and I'm probably gonna put myself in debt again for a third time just because of this goal okay all this equipment around me you know this doesn't this isn't like cheap you know this isn't like low grade quality equipment this is expensive equipment right here and I'm trying to use it to better myself you know but it's just not working and and it's just been aggravating me so much because with the depression and everything, it's been tough, you know, but it's just so many people promised me so many things, you know, they say they're going to help me with this, they say they want to do that, and in a way, I'm just kind of waiting here for them, and I'm, I have this huge project I wanted to do, and I'm getting all these people involved, and I know some of them just aren't going to stick with it, I, I know for a fact, and I know it's just going to aggravate me even more. I've really, I've been neglecting the whole making videos actually just to more to, I mean, just, it's like I'm buying the equipment, but I'm not using it to make the videos, which is kind of a waste. And I've actually kind of put my YouTube career on the side just to go pursue an acting career. And in reality, I, I didn't want that. I didn't want to be an actor, really. You know, I wanted to just be an entertainer to make you guys laugh. Because with an actor, you got to be told what to do. You got to be told who to be. You got to be told you can't do this, you can't do that. See, the reason why I went on YouTube was for two reasons. One was because no one could tell me what I couldn't and couldn't can and couldn't do. Okay, they didn't tell me I couldn't dress up in a morph suit and talk to myself, you know, as an alter ego. They didn't tell me I couldn't dress up in drag. They didn't tell me I could dress up as all these cartoon characters and go parade around my city. They would tell me to not do that. They would tell me to go dress up in a flannel, go dress up in a fucking suit, and go pretend to be this big shot, when in reality I'm just some low-grade punk from New Bedford. That's not me. I'm not some little pompous asshole actor who thinks he owns the fucking world like Dwayne Johnson, okay? I'm not that. I'm Logan Raposo. I'm the guy who wanted to change the world. I'm the guy who wanted to help people like me, who are depressed, who are lonely, who hate life, who hate even getting up in the morning. You want to something plain and simple? YouTube was the reason I got up every day. If I didn't have YouTube, I probably wouldn't be here right now. Straight up. It's just, you know, it boggles me, because I know I was at around like one, 
one, around the 110 area when I did that draw my life video. And all of a sudden, I just gained like eight, nine new subscribers just from telling my story, just from being me, you know? And I wasn't expecting positive feedback from that story, you know? I was expecting people to be like, oh, wow, you know, well, sorry that happened to you or you're a weirdo. But everyone was just really nice, which actually really shocked me. And the big reason, too, was why I went on YouTube was... Plain and simple, I don't know who I am. All my life, I've just copied people. All my life, I've just tried to be like everyone else. You know, I've never been able to truly be myself, in a way. And that's why I'm dropping those characters as well. I don't feel a need to dress up as characters that aren't mine, that aren't my creations. I just wanted to be myself, you know, because all my life I've never been myself. And it just, it aggravates me so much when I see people who are on YouTube who, who are good in a way, but just, they forget where they came from, you know, they forget what started them, they forget when they were nothing, you know, they just... They think now that they've made it, they don't need to care about people anymore. They don't have to say thank you to the fans. They don't have to do this. All they have to do is just make videos so they can make money, so they can make profit. It's not what it's about. You don't understand how powerful YouTube really is, okay? There's a lot of people out there who don't have nothing but a computer and stuff to go watch videos. And this is their escape. It's my escape. But people just don't get that, you know? I think it's just a game, really. This isn't a game to me. This is really all I have. You know? <laughs> I don't have much of a family. You know? I mean, like, well, I mean, I have friends. But I mean, like, I don't have them, like, every day. You know, my girlfriend left me and everything. So, I mean, I don't have that. So. There's not much here for me but this. And, you know, I'm going to end it with this. You know, I could bitch and moan for hours about how people get handed this, get handed that. You know, they get by on this. You know, people think they're cool or something, but then they, they just don't really thank anyone or anything. You know, all that, all that negative stuff. But I'm not going to do that. It's not me. That's not who I am. I don't feel a need to. I just want to tell you guys where I've been. I'll tell you guys what's been going on, you know, with the depression and everything. Plain and simple, I'm a human. I may be an entertainer. I may be a comedian. But there's always a dark side. So it's a side no one talks about. Depression's a real thing on YouTube. It's taking lives. So in that case, I think it's time for me to get back to work.